Welcome to the Yum Yum Yogi. Today we will be making Indian almond toli, or it's also called badam puri. Because we are what we think while making the food we eat, let's hold this thought while prepping this sweet. I am powerful because I remain close to truth and distant from doubt, enabling me to rise to any challenge and fly over any obstacle. For this recipe, we need one fourth of a teaspoon saffron and I'm heating up the saffron in a spoon because it brings out the flavor of the saffron like you're seeing on the screen. That's how you do it. And we need two cups of almonds. The almonds have to be blanched and skin removed. That's how they look. One fourth of a cup soy milk. It could be any milk. I'm using soy milk. One teaspoon cardamom powder. Half a cup of sugar. And of course the saffron. And now we preheat the oven to 375 degrees Fahrenheit. Process the almonds in a food processor. You have to process them in a way that half of it is fine almond meal and half of it is coarse crumbs. So transfer the almond meal crumbs into a bowl and add the sugar. Now we mix the saffron with the milk. And the best way to do it is take the edge of a bowl and crush the saffron like you're seeing on the screen. That really blends the saffron with the milk and that's how it looks after the saffron is blended with the milk. Add the cardamom powder. A teaspoon at a time add the saffron and the milk. So you you just add half of it before you add the whole thing and then start mixing the almond meal. It should form a dough like that. It's a hard dough and it should all be blended together. That's how it looks. Take two sheets of wax paper. They're about 15 inches by 12 inches. Take two sheets. And break the dough into two equal parts and take one part and with your hand round it as much as you can like you're seeing on the screen and then with the rolling pin in between the wax paper roll out the dough. The dough should be rolled out about three-eighths of an inch thick. Not too thick, not too thin. It should be about three-eighths of an inch thick. Take a cookie cutter Usually people use a round cookie cutter. I'm using a diamond one here. And shape the dough. With the butter knife, transfer the dough to a baking sheet prepped with parchment paper. There, that's how it should be transferred. That's how they look after they're transferred. And now heat this for 10 to 15 minutes in the oven for 375 degrees and that's how they look after they are done. They're so delicious. That's Indian almond cookie or badam puri. But before we do anything else, let's hold this thought. I am powerful because I remain close to truth and distant from doubt, enabling me to rise to any challenge and fly over any obstacle.